Do you think you'll be able to assist us medically if we need it? Tell me how you were captured by these aliens. What do you think the aliens want with us? Can you tell me more about where you're from? What do you know about this Toshiro Kago guy? I have to go now. Alright, let's start from the top. Can you assist us medically? I'd really like to, but when I woke up on this ship for the first time, all of my medical gear was gone. I saw that the aliens on this ship have some sort of viscous stuff they slather onto wounds. Some kind of biological gel. Get me mm -hmm. some of that, and I might be able to mess around with it, make some sort of adapted biogel we can use on ourselves. I have tons of it. Uh, but before we... Sure, let's let's try making adapted biogel. Sure, here you go. They should work pretty well, but watch out for side effects. Uh, what side effects? Oh, hey, what's up? I wasn't done talking to you, that's what. Uh, tell me how you were captured by these aliens. Well, it was getting dark. We'd spent the day out in the trenches, keeping as many of the guys alive as we could. Chinese had been pounding on us all day with artillery from these huge guns they had up on the mountains. It was really a mess. Anyway, we pitched our tents and stowed our gear to try and catch some shut-eye. I woke up suddenly, Private Dawkins screaming. He was bathed in some kind of blue light coming from the sky. All of us just froze as he just, well, vanished. We didn't know what happened. Did the Chinese come up with some new weapon? Moments later, all of us were in the blue light too. The rest, you know. This is true. Alright, what do you think the aliens want with us? What if this is just some horrible misunderstanding? Like, what if some radio waves got beamed into space and made it all the way to their planet? Only they didn't hear the nightly news or whatever. To them, it sounded like a declaration of war. So they decided to attack us first. Seriously, uh -huh. this whole thing could totally be our fault. Do you realize <sighs> that? Okay, um, if you say so. Can you tell me more about where you're from? Me? Well, I was a medic with the 108th Infantry Battalion stationed at Anchorage, Alaska. I was with a squad of five other medics. Our job was to patch everyone up after the commies gunned them down. It was pretty bloody. Nothing at all like I expected when I gave up my hospital job to enlist in the army. I see. Okay, what do you know about the samurai? He looks like a Japanese samurai. Guess the aliens must have plucked him from Earth a long time ago. I can't understand a word he's saying. <laughs> yeah, me neither. <laughs> okay, I have to go. Okay, tell me if you need medical assistance. You told me the only thing you're good for is Hiya, mister. adapting biogel. She said something about a cowboy. Where is a cowboy? I only see this guy and the other one. And her- Oh, there is a cowboy! Yo! Where are they? Where are the little buggers? Uh, the aliens are all over the place, that's why I woke you. If you're talking about the aliens, you'll see them soon enough. They're called aliens, Hayseed. Um... Uh, yeah, they're all over the place. Aliens? That what you call them? So you woke me, huh? Who the hell are you? I'm trapped on this ship just like you. I'm a human like you. I'm not a bad word kicking cowboy, that's for sure. Uh, Hadrian, I beg to differ. With the bonnet, you're even worse. Okay, um, I'm trapped on the ship as well. Do I really look that stupid, kid? This ain't a ship. I don't hear water, and I sure as hell don't feel us rocking. So tell me another one. <laughs> Besides, you don't look trapped to me. How do I know you ain't working with those little green bastards? Look, all I want is to work to do is to work together so as a team so we can go home. Um, if I were working with the aliens, why would I set you free? Uh, I don't give guarantees. You want out of here, you stick with me, period. Let's try logic again. You got a point there, kid. Let me out of that thing does count for something. Tell you what, I usually ride solo, but I'll stick with you for now. You try and pull anything stupid, and I'll bury you. Okay, sounds good. Yeah? What is it? Uh, tell me how you were captured by these aliens. Doesn't matter now. 
Only important thing is, well, I guess it's revenge. Revenge? <laughs> you are hilarious. Uh, what do you think these aliens want with us? Doesn't matter. They're not getting it, whatever it is. Can I take you back to the wasteland with you and just keep you as my permanent companion? That would be awesome. Can you tell me more about where you're from? Can't say as it matters, or that I'd feel like telling you anyway. Speech 57%. You can talk about what happened to you. It's okay. Sorry, forget I said anything. Um, this one sounds pretty stupid, but I'll try the speech check. I'll probably fail. Hey, yeah. here's an idea. Why don't you stop worrying about shit that doesn't matter? <laughs> okay. Fine. Ah, you're funny. Okay. What do you know about the samurai? Some sort of foreigner, obviously. Can't make out a word he's saying. Okay, that's a go. Suit yourself. I will. Yeah. Hey, you caught up, if didn't you? If you got something you want to say, spit it out. Uh, okay, she can do repairs. Okay, we can go through the same dialogue with her. Uh, since you seem so familiar with my gear, do you know how to repair it? Well, I wonder, can you repair my bonnet? Actually, I do. I used to tinker with all sorts of junk back home. I'd be glad to take a look at what you need fixed, but it's gonna cost you some caps. Well, given the circumstances, doesn't that seem kind of pointless? Yeah, fine, whatever, just take a look. You've got to be kidding me. Doesn't it sound pointless? Maybe to <coughs> you, it does. But hey, I gotta think about the future. If we get back down there and I'm broke, how am I going to survive? You know Fair as point. well as I do that there are no handouts in the wasteland. Yeah, I guess you're right. No way, Soma. This is ridiculous. Sure, you're right. Good. I'm glad we see eye to eye. Now, let me see what you need fixed. Can you fix my, uh... That's 179. Where's the bonnet? Can you fix my bonnet? Three caps. Excellent. Do it. Okay. Um... I don't think I really need her to fix this. No, yeah, that's okay. Done. So... Aha! It's up to full now. Thank you! <laughs> I hope you enjoy those three caps. <laughs> I'm amused that she knows how to fix a bonnet. Okay, I saw some of those... These things. I want all of them. Wow! So you were down there when all this started? Right before the bombs before fell? Nine. It's crazy! I guess so. I can't believe they went ahead with the nukes. I mean, they wiped everything out. How stupid could they be? You don't seem the soldier type, Decorian. Why the heck did you join the army in the first place? <laughs> join? I was forced into service. I worked in a hospital before I was in the army. They put the gun in my hand. Ever pulled a trigger on that gun? You know, ever kill someone? I can't believe I'm saying this, but I actually miss those old Salisbury steaks back home. You guys are an interesting bunch. This is my conclusion. Uh, any more of those things? Yeah, it looks like everybody has one. Hello, samurai dude. You are cool. I like your outfit. Hiya, mister. Why are you just staring at this corpse? Search curl narrow heart again. Okay. Can get a spacesuit. Oh, the armor's the astronaut died? What's with his neck? That is really freaky. That's a little better, I guess, but still freaky. Hey, I found no. the thing. Oh that poor astronaut. Those freezers are so dangerous. Sometimes people don't wake up. I guess you better take his suit. You're going to have to go if he can't. But first, you have to get to the door to the outside. They'll be waiting for you. But you can suck out all the air and part of the ship so they won't get in your way. They have mm -hmm. these generator things that power parts of the ship and make sure it has air. You'll have to turn some of them off. There's one in the cryo lab, one in the hangar bay, and one where they make the robots, the robot assembly area. Once okay. they're all broken, you can get through that door to the outside. And then, once you get to the top of the ship, 
You can turn the teleporter thing back on, and I can catch up to you. How the hell do you know this? It's time for me to get those doors unlocked for you now. This is fun. How do you know this? How do you know what's outside the ship? That's really weird. Uh, so what are these generators? How do they work? Oh, you'll know them when you see them. You push this button, and then this big thing is like, whoosh, and it comes out of the floor. And then, uh -huh. there are these things you press down, and it goes, and then you better get out of the way. You'll see. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for being so detailed. Um, what do you know about this Toshiro Kago guy? Um, I think he's from the Earth's past. There are people frozen all over the ship that the aliens grabbed wearing funny old-time clothes and stuff. Interesting. I have to go now. Don't go alone. Those generators are in scary places. Take one of the grown-ups with you. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure I can handle it alone, but whatever you say, kiddo. Okay, I need to go to the cryo lab. First, let's listen to these uh, these thingies that I picked up. Uh, notes. Recorded log seven. <laughs> He is not very happy. Log 5. Where's my wife? Where's my boy? What have you done with them? When I get free, so help me God, I'm gonna kill every last one of you. Ah! What are you doing? What the hell do you want with us? Let me go! Aw, oh, poor cowboy. Okay, log six. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, 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 shit. Ah! Uh, just let me go, okay? This is crazy. This is like batshit unbelievable crazy. I didn't do anything! I don't know <laughs> what you want with me. Is this because of Anchorage? I swear, I didn't even want to be there, man. You gotta believe me. I didn't even want to be out in the field. I was hoping for a job in Washington, you know? <laughs> what? What do you want? I don't understand. Why is this happening to me? I feel bad for these this guy. He's so pathetic. It's like a puppy. I feel like I need to lead him around by the hand or something. Okay, log eight. This is this is incredible. I'm I'm Colonel Hardigan of the United States Air Force. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't understand. Oh, uh, speaking to this? Yes. I was saying, I'm Colonel Hardigan, United States Air Force. Our nation has been conducting manned spaceflight tests. And <laughs> I'm sorry. You'll have to forgive me. Frankly, we never expected to meet you all. I'm sure there's a great deal that our two species can learn from- Ow! Ow! What the hell? What is this? What are you doing? Yeah. Aw, oh, poor astronaut. You were so naive. <laughs> okay. Uh, why is everyone marching over here? Oh, the door opened. Okay, destroy the generator in the cryolabs and the hangar. Something on your mind. The robot assembly. Uh, not right now. But you said you didn't want to talk to me in the first place, so... Um, I think, yeah, this is today. Okay! Do 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 There we go. Okay, so how do I take a grown-up with me into the places? Uh, what's that? What you want? What? I was trying to pick that up, not talk to you. That was weird. <laughs> okay. Um, do you know anything helpful about the other sections of the ship? It's a pretty big place, and I've only seen some of it. Always catch me before I see the whole thing. I've seen the cryo lab. That's where they freeze people and cut them up and stuff. And the hangar. Lovely. That has the aliens' flying ships and all the stuff they need to fly them. 
And the robot assembly is where they build the big metal robots they use. But the real important stuff is on the top of the ship. I've never been there. Okay. How do you know the important stuff is there then? Be careful, mister. Yeah, yeah, you too, kiddo. Um... Where are we going? We're going to multiple places, I assume. What's through here? Uh, activate switch. I can't do that. It does nothing. Uh, oh, there's a box that I can open, though. Epoxy, blah, 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 worm food. Yum, yum. More epoxy. Alrighty. Uh, 